Hello, hi everybody. How's it going? It is, today is Friday, the 14th of January, and we're doing another lovely, chill, cosy uh, D&D painting stream. And hopefully we're gonna finish my my lovely lovely shay <laughs> today um so feel free to look um do whatever you want just sit back and chill i'll put some music on as well by the lovely dark fantasy studio and we'll just have a good a grand old time um let me know if there's any issues if i have any problems oh, who's there who's there Hello, good morning, my love. How are you doing? Thanks for hopping in. I realise the music's a little bit loud. I'm just going to turn it down a smidge. I'm never quite sure how to get the audio right. How are you doing this fine morning, anyway? I hope you're doing alright. Um, it's a lovely day. And I'm feeling fresh, I'm feeling good. I got my got my Zelda mug that you got me, and I'm drinking a really tasty herbal tea, which I can't quite remember the flavour of off the top of my head, but it's called Calm. So radiating calmness today. In this lovely morning. <sighs> right, uh, let's get let's get to it. Let's let's carry on with the scales, I think. Um Carry on with the scales. Ooh, whoops, nope, not that thick. Um, that was left over from some art I was doing yesterday. Um, there we go. Right, what's what's cooking? I'm good, thank you. I have I I have been reading and then writing to do so. I thought I would whack you on in the background. I'll be a lurker today, I'm afraid. OMG the mug. <laughs> How are you? Um, I'm doing really good. Um, I, I feel I feel fresh, I feel good. Um, been very productive um, over the last few days. Um, been very productive over the last few days. Just been just all around having a nice cozy January. I've been I've been having quite a nice a nice time this January. Uh, Mike's asleep, so that's why I'm trying to keep my voice soft, like a like a graveyard shift radio DJ, about to bring you the latest hits in all things chill, um, <laughs> to help get you through that night long uh, commute. <laughs> well, I guess no one should be doing that right now. Um, <laughs> Um, Mike's asleep. I'm gonna go wake him up um, at ten, and bring him coffee, and then I'll be right back. <laughs> this music, <laughs> bringing you all the latest hits in in modern fantasy. Um, <laughs> What's this track called? This track is... <laughs> this track is Joke from Dark Fantasy Studios' The Chronicles of the Illusion World. <laughs> um, I respect Mike's sleepiness so much. I've been trying to sort my sleep schedule out a bit uh, for uni starting on Monday. Oh, is that starting up on Monday? Oh my god, good luck. Yeah, I saw, congratulations, I saw you were up and up and ready yesterday while I was still asleep. <laughs> oh, good luck, my sleep schedule is just a mess. Um, I just let, I just let my body do whatever the, whatever the heck it wants these days. <laughs> but at least with the streaming I can get up at eight and be ready for nine and that seems to be going okay. I've done the scales a bit smaller here. A little bit more. A bit more precise. Am I on the right layer? Yeah. Um, no, good luck. 
Oh, how are you feeling about uni starting on Monday? You're welcome to just lurk if you want to. It's all good. There's like a exclamation mark lurk command, so you can just let me know. Um, if you want to, you don't have to though. Um... Um, I've set an alarm for like half seven and managed to be up and dressed by about now, which is a lot better than last week. I was waking up from 10. Well done, that's awesome. You're doing great. <laughs> you're, yeah, you're getting right back into it. You're so... Whoa. Why did the... Why did the... Symbol... Symbol scare me for a second. I was like, what is that? <laughs> um... No, that's awesome. Um, I hope you're able to keep it up. I'm sure you will. You're gonna, you're gonna absolutely smash it this term. I know you will. And we should definitely catch up as well before you start uni. I'd like. To, I'm sorry I couldn't do it the other day. We should definitely have a lovely little Animal Crossing session. Maybe you, me, and Mike, and and Loz and Nat if they want to hop in as well. That would be really nice before you all get back to uni. Um, cool. Oops, whoops. Thanks, sweetie. I need to. And don't be silly. You can't help it. You're a busy bee. Yes, please. Yes. I've said it live on stream now. Um, so you can, you can quote me on this. <laughs> I've got at least one chill pirate tune in here. I think this one's called Black Flag. I think. Oh, that's quite short though. Put it back on. I like it. Um, maybe that inspired them to do the album Black Flag. No. Um, or Black Sails. No, the album's called Black Sails. I'm getting it modelled up with the um, Assassin's Creed game, which I haven't played yet, but I really want to. Um, we start Monday, but our timetable is so chill. We have Mondays and Wednesdays off. Oh, good. That's good. I'm glad. I'm glad it's chill. Hopefully, it might feel a bit more chill this time. Um, first term always seems. I don't know about you guys, but every year, first term is always the craziest term. Um, <laughs> But yeah, you're going to smash it, you guys are going to do great, you're going to get through this. No matter what happens, it's all going to be good. Why is my music not playing suddenly? Come on, come back. Okay, there we go, sorry. Yeah, you guys are going to smash it, don't even worry about that. Let's get a bit. Ah, sorry, just dropped my pen for some reason. Hopefully the scales won't take the whole stream. But I had to go and make her wear very little clothing, didn't I? Her legs, her legs are, her shins are exposed. Most of her arms are exposed. And her midriff. Um, 
Yeah, first term was hell, but uni has been really distant apart from like one lecturer, ironically the one we've been moaning about. He has his stuff together when it comes to student support. Yes, I remember you saying. Um, I remember you saying um, you were able to talk to him. Um, that's really good. Yeah. Universities, guys, please talk to your students, for goodness sake. It really doesn't take a lot, does it? Gosh. It's really sad. Honestly, the way a lot of places have been handling this. But we plough on and we and we don't and we don't just quietly take it, we, we let them know how we feel. Send them all the emails, all the phone calls, talk about it on social media, get get your get your voices heard guys. Because this isn't fair on anyone. No one deserves the miscommunication. It's horrible. It feels horrible. Um, and we had a meeting we had to go to yesterday and it was just, we are a great school and we want to remind you of that so you can upvote us. And we were all like, um, no, you've been rubbish. <laughs> we needed you. Did you all tell them that? Good. No, tell them. I remember once, oh, I remember they would try and come in, like, during the normal times. They would, like, come in and try and do surveys. It would always be at the worst time. They'd be like, hey, could you just, like, do this little survey on how great we are? After, like, the strikes went down and the, and the union didn't even handle it properly. <laughs> um... It's rubbish. Up for us guys, get us back on the back on the board. Um if you wanna be back on the good university board, what do they call it? Like the university ranking board. I can't even put my banking on it. Um why don't you actually do the things you're promising guys? <sighs> oh well. Wow. Well. I'm glad you got, I'm glad one of your lecturers is on it. Um, I really hope they get to a level of shit together at some point. Um, and you're able to have a better term. Um, are you, um, are you traveling back to your student accommodation at all? Or are you staying? where you are, I'm not gonna <laughs> dox you. <laughs> um, also, if you just wanna keep lurking, let me know. And I will direct my conversation elsewhere. <laughs> ah, it's frozen again, love it. No, I don't wanna create any loops. I want to, ah, oh, there we go. Ah, cool, got it. doing. The other ones are a bit more erratic, let's uh, make them a bit more Um, 
for now we're staying in uh, Goddy, but will pubs go back early Feb or something? Sorry, sweetie, I've had to put washing on, so if you ask me a question, I miss it. No worries, it's all good. I was just, I was just letting you know. Um, oh, hey, sorry, I didn't see. You guys come up as the same colour on my phone, so. Hi, Rograkshi, I hope you're doing all right. <laughs> yeah, no worries, it's all good. No, I was just asking if you were, oh my gosh, why is my nose sniffling? I was just asking if, um, if you were coming back, um, or you were just going to stay. Um, you guys have got this. I believe in you all. You can do this. It's going to be A-OK. -okay. Don't you worry. Um, it's going to be so worth it. Oh, are they brought back in the no detriment again? As well. Oh yeah, I think I'm going to tidy up the shadows a little bit before I carry on with the scales as well. Have they brought in the no detriment policy again? Because that would be grand if so. To this day, I'm still not even sure if we were if we got the no detriment thing or not <laughs> when I was studying. I suppose we didn't really need it to be honest because of the spot we were at, but I don't know. Yeah, that's a good idea to sort out the shadows now, tidy them all up, so we don't get confused when we move on to the colouring. Sorry everybody. Um, he's now gaming, so Pops won't be a response, no worries. Ah, thank you. Um, we are Kent bound in February. We don't know yet. I think they're updating it. Yeah, I think so. They should be. They can't not do it again this year. It's just... It's been a mess for everyone. I feel so bad for like anyone starting like fresh like first year this year. If I was if I had just finished sixth form, I would have definitely done a gap year. Like there's no way I could have gone to uni while all this is going on. That'd be insane. Um, God speak to those who did. You troopers. You absolute troopers. Right. Sorry, everybody. What I missed? Uh, my camp bound. I don't know yet. I think I'll get it. Yeah. Hopefully, hopefully they will update it, and all will be well, and it's all good. Oh, who's that? I love watching you put the details in. Oh, thank you. <laughs> right now, we're sort of just uh, yeah, we're going in and cleaning everything up and. Making shit pop a bit. Oh my gosh, excuse me. Making stuff pop a bit. <laughs> excuse my language, everybody. Got a bit too relaxed there. I was like, oh, I'm just, I'm just talking to my friend. It's all good. <laughs> I need to remember. 
<laughs> I'm live on a family friendly channel. Um, <laughs> uh, cool. Oh, nice, cool. Uh, come back, come back. There we go. <sighs> what are you up to today, anyway? What's everyone? What's everyone up to? What are, what are we all doing? I played some Luigi's Mansion yesterday. That game is great. It's beautiful. Um, fully recommend that if anyone's looking for any new Switch games to try. Um, and that was a, a, such a treat. Honestly, the game was an absolute treat. What is? Um, my, my folks got it for me for Christmas and it was great. Um, hmm. Let me let me see. I know we've got the light covering it up, but we still want to make it look tidy. Right, who's here? Uh, I love to chill. Oh, I really want to try Luigi's Mansion. I was not writing this to assembly. Oh, gosh. Good luck. Oh. Got quite a few friends still doing their master. You're writing essays. Um, F in chat to everyone <laughs> having to write essays. Whoa. Um, F in chat to everyone who write essays and deadlines, <laughs> especially in January, because having deadlines in January really is is rubbish. I, I did not I did not enjoy having deadlines in January when I was at uni. I think I still need a little bit of shading there. A bit of surface shading here. Um, yeah. Other than that, I think it's good. Oops. Bring that in. Yeah, all fine. All fine and dandy. Um, she's not particularly muscular, so I shouldn't make this too defined, but people generally tend to. Oh, I think I'll bring it up a bit as well. There we go. Um, people generally tend to have a little dip here. Um, even if you are quite heavy. And Shay is yet another relatively heavy character. Not too heavy though. Not definitely not as heavy as my other ones. Probably this probably the smallest D&D character I've ever played as, and she's still like six foot and probably like 300 pounds or something. Um, <laughs> I haven't played a, a quite a skinny character, I don't think so. I've, I've got like, I've got like smaller characters like in the lineup, um, but I don't think I've ever actually played anyone particularly small. Well, I guess Columbina's quite small, she's three foot two, but she's also like enormous for her size, so. <laughs> Which is very fun. Um, D and D characters with different body types are extremely fun. And I'm not just talking about racial um racial differences.
Okay. Hands always look like mush, don't they? Yeah, they do. But it's okay. We'll give them more detail once we're colouring. How's it going, everybody? Yeah, suddenly didn't get very. I, I stopped being very chatty for that for a second. Um, Okay, this is much better. I love going with the eraser after doing the shadows, it always just brings things to life that bit more. <laughs> um, do we think we'll finish today? What do you reckon, guys? I don't think so. Um, I've got a feeling that this is going to take a while. A very strong feeling. I kind of don't want this to end. Oh, also, if any of you saw the other day, my uh, I did a little mini test stream, and uh, yeah, I can I can now I can now do like modelling streams, which I'm really excited to do. 3D modelling streams. Which is very exciting. Um, so, one of, in the near future, I'll probably be doing some 3D sculpting and modelling for you guys, which I think would be really fun. Fun to do. Whoa. I am suddenly very sleepy. I think that tea was a bit too calming. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, you're allowed to not be not chatty, I believe in you. Aww. <laughs> Thanks, Hot. Thanks, Hazard. That's really sweet of you. Ah, <laughs> oh, goodness me, I'm sorry guys, I'm so sleepy. Let me just clean my tissue. Real quick. Let me just deal with that. I'll turn off the microphone. Real quick. That was a good time to mute my when my alarms went off. That I need to change because um, normally I was originally going to start stream at ten, but I've been waking up a bit earlier, so nine o'clock it is, and I've just had a very long message in the chat. Better check that. Um, oh, okay. Story time. I've been my landlord's photographer a little bit as I have with Canon, so I can get some high resolution photos of them. They've taken full advantage of this and asked if I can photograph the whole house. I forgot to do the kitchen for ages, added to the fact it was a bloody mess, student kitchen's yuck, and she just asked me again to send the photos, and I've gone to find them and I can't, so I don't know if I did or not. Anyway, this minute I was on my camera and looking through old photos, and some are stellar, so I'm furiously downloading them as screensavers from the tablet. <laughs> That's awesome. You should, you should set up an account and stuff, like a public profile, and have like a little photography and crafts page, that would be really cool. You should def definitely send me some of your, your pictures. I'd love to see them. I bet they're really good. Canons are great. I've got I've got a good old Nikon. I love my Nikon.
Um, just don't know if I'm that good. No, you should give it, give it a try. Put it up. I'd love to see them. That would be really cool. We're a basic one with two lenses and I just love it. That's awesome. And uh, also, I'm sorry about the, uh, the lost photos. I hope, you, I hope you're able to find them or take them. <laughs> um, but no, I bet you're great. I mean, if your landlord likes them. moving her crotch upwards because I realised I feel like her legs should be quite long. A lot of my D&D &D characters have um, similar legs to mine in that they're quite short, um, but I feel like Shay would have quite long legs, so I'm just um, moving, adjusting the shading on her um, parachute pants. <laughs> Luckily I don't have to do too much to it, to sort of... imply that it's higher, her legs are longer. Yeah, thanks to these types of trousers I don't have to do too much to it. <laughs> Longer. <laughs> um, to dump your messenger boo. Oh, oh, thank you. When I next time I get next time I have a break, I'll uh, I'll uh, check it out. <laughs> thank you very much. Right then. Just realised hopefully I'm not speaking too loud. I don't want to wake Mike up when they don't want to wake up. Right, thank you for hopping in today. This has been cosy, just the two of us. Uh, check on the highlights now. Tam, how are you doing? How's things, honey? Happy, happy Friday. It's almost the weekend. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> how 
How are you doing, my lovely? Friday, we're all missing you. Oh, I'm missing you too. I'm missing you guys so much, honestly. I love you all very much. <laughs> I cannot wait for this COVID nonsense to be over, honestly. I haven't, guys, I haven't seen my family in almost a year, that's insane. Um, and I miss them terribly. Can, can the virus go away please? And let me see my family, because that would be real nice. That would be very nice of it, <laughs> to let me see them. I'm just, I'm just really glad we're all playing it safe. Um, just as long as we're all staying safe now, so we can see each other a bunch in the long term. It will be good. We'll all be a-okay. What are you guys, how... Yes, it does. It really does. Code needs to go away, please. <laughs> oh no, did I hack something? Uh, yeah. Oh no. Whoops. That's not good. I can't do that. Got the layers mixed up, fellas. Because of course I did. There we go. Back again. Da 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 da. Okay. Scales come back. Um, let's carry on with the scales. Let's get them done. And let's check the chat. Um, happy Friday, Mums and you. We get it, we understand your, your wrath. Now please leave. I feel like Apollo is sitting on a cloud feeling particularly happy with himself for this plague. <laughs> yeah. Sure, 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 done did a good one. Um, it's, really, it's really got us, didn't it? It's really got us where it stings. <laughs> As long as we all stay safe and stay home and stay cozy, and we can all and we all get our vaccines and we're all gonna get out of this, no problem. Um, I've seen potentially pharmacies are gonna offer the vaccine privately if you wanna skip the queue. I think I need to look it up more. But if you're in the UK and you want your vaccine a bit sooner, you might be able to... 
the same way you can, you know, pay to have a flu jab done. Um, they might be doing like the COVID vaccine. You can either like wait on the NHS or you can go just get it, get it done. I think. I don't know how much it's going to be though. I need to double check. But I saw BBC talking about it yesterday. So that's good. Exactly, everyone stay home. From living in Frith Bethlehem, I just have a whole new perspective on the whole situation. She's a nurse in the ICU, they're completely around SWAT in the overrun of COVID patients. Oh, that would be amazing. It would be amazing. Oh, excuse me. Yeah. You know, it's really cool. Um, no, it's a good idea, especially since like everyone was just mobbed over here. But yeah, no, she must be. Beth must be so stressed with everything going on. Yeah, the hospitals have overrun, having to make take horrible, horrible measures. So please, everyone, stay home. Um, for goodness sake. <laughs> and if anyone here was at the protests in front of the church, in front of um, was it St Thomas's Hospital in London? If anyone was saying COVID was a hoax and protesting in front of a hospital, um. Get, go ahead and block yourself and get, get off this channel. Because <laughs> if you still believe COVID is a hoax, well, got some news for you, my friend. <laughs> um, I can't believe the amount of people that still believe it's a hoax. hoax. It's insane, the level of selfishness out there. But it's okay. Because there are some real good people out there doing some real good things to help get us right through this. Oops, wrong layer again. <laughs> oh, goodness me, I'm not with it right now. Um, she's dreadful because you're supposed to have two ICU nurses in an indicated COVID patient, but they normally have one. Uh, so if you don't believe hospitals are overrun, no, the normal sections aren't, but the intensive care units, which are where COVID patients have to go to RCS, they hope to stay safe, however, by being indoors and limiting contact with people. Please. Also, Jane, I love that. Get off this channel. Yeah, go ahead and block yourselves. <laughs> I literally have two people watching. I really doubt any sort of COVID protest. I like COVID protesters are going to be on here. Not anti COVID, anti -COVID pro protesters, aren't they? Um. <laughs> Anyway, let's like a little bit because I th because I'm just gonna turn into such a Debbie Downer if I keep talking about the COVID stuff. But you are right. Um, it's the it's the parts of the hospital treating COVID patients. Um, They're just swamped right now. And they could really do with some more some more help. And the best way we can help, if we can, is by literally staying planted inside. <laughs> Which sounds like a good way to help to me.
Hmm. Yeah, let's continue with the scales, guys. Get these scales done, because I really want to add some colour to her today. I really do. Um, you never know, I add that. I respect you so much. Oh, I respect you too, dude. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> no, don't be sorry, it's all good. You, can, you guys can bring up whatever you want. Um, my brain was just like, oh, COVID. <laughs> um, you never know, I had that random massage. Yeah, you know, people, people can... People can crop up all over the place. Um, so we'll see. <laughs> Animal Crossing New Horizons. Good, 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 good suggestion. My brain is turning to mush. Um, I haven't played Animal Crossing New Horizons in a while. It's really bad. I got all of the Frozen stuff and then I stopped playing. <laughs> um, even though I haven't fully decorated my town yet. With it. Um, <laughs> how is your, how is your, is anyone else, anyone else? I'm going. How's your towns? What are you working on? What's happening? I've basically kept all the Halloween stuff up. I've kept up all the Halloween stuff and putting all the frozen stuff out. So it's just going to be like a, a seasonal town. <laughs> and I don't ever want the end to end. I don't ever want winter to end because it's so pretty in Animal Crossing. It's so gosh darn pretty. That scimitar is bugging me. There we go. That's better. Okay, cool, we just started talking about Animal Crossing. It's all good. I might have to pop off in a second to get Mike his coffee and then I'll be right back. Come on, let's get these scales finished. We've literally just got one. One limb to finish them on. What's been going on in everyone's Animal Crossing towns? What are we all making? What are we all planning at the moment? Oh, and also, why am I warm? It's like, I haven't got the heater on. Why don't I have the heater on? Oh. I just realised it's really warm. I'm going to take my scarf off. And the blanket. There we go. Perfect. The blanket was just too much. <laughs> cool. Scales done. Scales done. Okay. Time is up. Sorry, I had it all. Yeah, no worries. It's all good. Um, cool, we've got the scales done. 
Um, let's uh, let's add a bit of colour, shall we? Let's stop, and then I will run off and grab the coffee. Um, So what we're going to do, because we don't obviously don't want the shadows to be like stark black or stark white, you know, like we want them to blend in better with the rest of the piece. We're going to do some change the layer blending to make the shadows complement the colours. We'll just do some rough colouring, 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 do some rough, rough colours first. <laughs> do some rough colours first. Just to get it started. Right, uh, and then we'll do the hair as well. Let's do the hair right here as well, like this. And then we'll check out the blending in a second. Going to have to be much more precise with the colours. Hmm. Right, let's go back to normal. What are, how are we doing? Right, I'm just going to stop for a couple of minutes. I'm going to leave it here. I'll, I'll do a little, I'll be right back note for anyone who... For anyone who hops in, um, feel free to say hi. And yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back in a few minutes. Mwah.
Good stretch. Coffee has been delivered. Everyone is all good here. Right, let's get sorry, everybody. And the headband is off. It's giving me a bit of a headache. So I do apologize for my hairline right now. <laughs> but it's okay. It somehow. It's okay. It happens. Okay, if I miss anything, everybody, let's have a look. Right, okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's see if we can. <sighs> okay. See if we can sort this all out, everybody. Just adding colour, adding the base colours. And away we go. I originally had a colour scheme as sort of like a light purple. Um, I'm thinking maybe we should go with. We should probably go with more of a green, go with like a more green silver colour scheme. I think that would be quite cool. That feels more appropriate for a Juventi. Uh, yeah. Okay. Can you guys hear me alright? Sorry. Ooh. Sorry about the microphone bash just there. <laughs> That's never fun to be on the receiving end of. <laughs> right. And my eyelashes too. Let's cut these guys in. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, let's have the outline in for a bit. Colour it all in. That 
see, you see that makes it easier. sort out the detailing of the hair later. Flatten, colour in, clipping mask, flatten. Cool. That's better. Oh, whoops. That's not. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. Oh, hang on. Sorry, guys. Um, I just crashed. Uh, hello. No, sorry, mild break over here. I almost didn't realize her when I came back. Um, <laughs> that's okay. Just look like splotches of color. <laughs> oh, I hope it's saved. Why did it crash? Sorry, everyone, it just crashed, so I'm just sorting that out now. There we go. Boy, I think we're good now. Yeah. No, we're just doing we're doing the colours and stuff now. So uh, yeah, I don't I don't blame you for being like what what is this? <laughs> um. Keep going with the colours. Oh no, no. Doesn't look right. What's that? What's happened? Do you see that guys? A bunch of the um shadow layer has been erased. The rest of it looks fine. That's so strange. And very annoying. Um, okay, I... <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, cool, that's fun. Thanks, uh, Procreates. <laughs> um, I'll deal with that in a second. Um, that's so frustrating. <laughs> oh, well, it happens. It happens sometimes. Um, Let's group all these together. Bring them to the top. What is going on? Why is that there now? Okay. Um, on second thought, I'm going to hide these two layers. I'm going to open this one and just carry on with the block colouring for now because I don't want to look at that right now. <laughs> yeah, you look <sighs> I'm going I'm going insane guys. That's it. That's why I'm just I'm just so tired. I'm too tired. I should just go to bed. <laughs> Okay. 
Jade, these things happen. It's all part of the process. Thank you, Procreate. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, oh, sorry, that's really distracting me. I no, I need to I need to sort that out because it's really distracting. Um, okay. Oh, for goodness sake, why why did that happen? Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Jade, it's okay. Oh boy. It's just a little chunk. It's not like all of it's just disappeared. It's just a little chunk. Go. Just a little chunk. Of her arm. Nothing to nothing to fret about. As long as the scale is okay, that's all I care about. <laughs> um, that's all I care about. Okay, this is, this is a good fix. This is a good fix. Okay. Oh. Okay, good fix. Okay, let's give her some sort of green get up, shall we? Who's that? Good morning. Morning, how are you doing? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> um, we've just been sorting out some weird glitches that were just going on, but I think I think they're all good now. How are you? How are you doing this fine morning? Thank you for popping in. How are you and me, Osis? No, just, just go nuts with the colours and then you can sort it out later. Okay. Um. Probably should have drawn this on a different layer. Don't worry, well, uh, future me can deal with that. <laughs> me in two minutes' time can deal with that.
we're just doing we finished doing the scales and now we're just uh adding all the sort of block coloring um to then morph into the uh, other layers with layer blending tricks trickery <laughs> oh love it Oh, goodness me, I am a mess today. It's, it's all good, it's all fine and dandy. Um, Uh, lurk in a meeting at the moment. Sit back and relax. <laughs> Why did it? I was supposed to pick up your username. Why did it pick up the that's weird? Uh, thank you for your support. Oh, there's another one question in the chat. Oh my gosh, that was my pick up your username. I don't know why I just picked up the first letter. Sorry about that. <laughs> no worries, guys. Enjoy, enjoy. Um, always, always happy for you all to look. <laughs> Right, and I'll just I'll just talk talk my process through as I draw. Uh, for anyone else who pops in, because um, that's like a okay with me. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm on the TV. I'm on TV. No, oh gosh. <laughs> right, so this is looking a bit weird at the moment, but we're just doing block coloring over the top just so I can make sure I don't miss anything. Um. So I don't miss any essential, any essential parts. So there's no problems. Is that? Uh, I'm gonna bring the line art to the top to use as a ref better reference. Oh yeah, that's not correct. Um, didn't think that was shaped quite right. There we go. Get rid of it. Uh, as for the trousers, we'll make them a much darker green to get close to black. Oh, she's gonna have massive piccolo energy, um, which I love. Piccolo from Dragon Ball. I think Piccolo is like my favorite character. Piccolo and Frieza, top tier characters. Love them so much. Um, but yeah, we'll just zh, 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 zh. squiggle, squiggle, squiggle. Just color that stuff in. Color, 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 color. Color, 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 color. Missing. Let's do the legs next. Oh. Nope. Don't need that. 
that alarm today. That's my alarm to go wake up my partner with a coffee. <laughs> Because I am an early bird and Mike is a night owl. So we have slightly different sleep schedules. But it's quite nice because we kind of get time to ourselves. So Mike gets time to himself at night and I get time to myself in the morning. And we just hang out with each other the rest of the day. It's lovely. Um, or usually I'll be in here working because I just, I just, I, I, I just, I just work too much. Um, <laughs> whoops. Wrong layer. This one. Yeah, keep going with the block colours, and then we'll tidy it all up later. Give her little green slippers. Who's there? Is anyone else there? Bob actually loved feature trunks. To be fair, he just didn't give a damn. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, f trunks, future tr trunks is cool. Um, I don't really remember a lot of stuff of trunks. I have to admit, because I only ever watched the, I watched an abridged version, and I've seen a bunch of the movies, and I've played the Dragon Ball Fighter Z games. Um, game is one. It was just no, they've been releasing no DLC. Um, which has been awesome. I love Android 21 so much, the villain in that game. She's so good. Um, yeah, it's mostly the villains I really, really like. It's like the villains in Piccolo are the only ones I really, I really care for in Dragon Ball. But yeah, future trunks seem really cool. Um, Shade does not waste her time with makeup, so we won't. Whoa, no. Oh no. Where's the scales? Okay, we're there. I'm a little bit paranoid because some of the stuff just disappeared after the app crashed. So I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit worried that other things are disappearing. Um, <laughs> gosh. Um, okay. Don't panic. Just be calm. Shit, there's one makeup. Okay. Um, let's do the inside of your mouth. Um, maybe have some teeth up here. So just poking through a little bit. We'll find this like that. No, stop it. Stop freezing. <laughs> Please stop. Uh, okay, it's fine. It happens. It's okay. Oh, stretch. Okay. 
Okay. Um, should we do the scimitar? Right, let's do the scimitar and then work our way down. Let's give it a... Should we give it a golden hilt? A silver hilt? I'm going to give it a silver hilt. Put that layer right down here. Colour it in. Next door. <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh, we're full. Hang on a sec. Just realized something about the hand. Um I think I did the shadowing properly on that. Oh yeah, it'll just be covered up by her other fingers, that's fine. Well, I suppose the thumb should be over the top, right? Yeah. Okay, that'll do for now. Okay, back to colouring the hilt. I know this is a very exciting part, guys, but it is tis tis needed. Um, do the blade next. The blade underneath the make the blade lighter in color. Put it underneath the hilt, and away we go. Hide the outline. There we go. right now but just gotta let the songs flow when they come into my head <laughs> uh, okay hand wrap the hand wrap wrap will be the same colour as her trousers. Um, 
it will go behind the hilt and in front of the mode. Like this. Um, hide that layer for now. bands on her wrists will be the same colour as the hilt in front of the hand wrap. I'll also colour in the, the bands on the lower arm as well. Keep it on the same layer. Like this. Like that. And then bring the arm. Um, behind that The fingers on a separate layer. Bring all the colours together like this. Group it, group it. And let's just colour in fingers so everything else hidden. Let's just go over the nails as well. It's just easy that way. Hide that. Colour the nails. The nails will be the same colour as, as the wraps and the trousers. Like this. Um, let's bring down that layer so I can see it better. She's got very long nose. Seems impractical, but she's a UNT, and I. I don't know, I just have this idea that they have like kind of vampire like features as well as snake like features. Um, long nails and scaly skin. And snake like eyes. Okay. How are we doing? Uh, cool. We're working our way down. I think we'll leave the face for now.
do the necklace. Or the, or the bit that's holding up her shirt, I guess. <laughs> Probably want to put it behind the hair. Wherever, where's the hair? Oh, it's in the... Put it there. Oh, that's weird. That shouldn't be there. Get rid of that. <sighs> Stretch. Have I missed anything? Sorry, everybody. Nope. Oh, just need to stretch. And probably could do this on the same layer. There we go. Let's get rid of the outline. Uh, okay. She doesn't have wristbands on this arm. Oh yeah, no. The wraps just go on a bit longer. Yeah. I like the asymmetry of that. So that will stay in. Did I? No, I didn't. Okay. Didn't do those wraps. Um, put this here. Those parts of the bracelet's finished. Um, oh, the trousers have not really coloured in very well. But definitely prefer this colour scheme to the other one I had going. Cool. Um, gonna have to get rid of the trouser layer so I can draw all this in. There we go. Get rid of that layer too. Draw in hand wraps. If it goes over the thing, it shouldn't matter too much. There. And now the sword hilt. Oh, hang on a sec. Before we do that. No, just stick to what you're doing. I just want to wrap. There. So, next sword hilt, please. There we go.
This one's close. Yes, please don't glitch out on me again. Procreate, I'd really appreciate that. Thank you. Hmm. And now the scimitar. The second scimitar. fix the uh, outlines later. Just want to get the colours in. That's all we're focusing on right, right now. Okay, uh, bring the trousers back, bring all the layers back, see what we need to do. Oh, is it all done? Uh, okay, I think all the base colours are done. Oh, not here. Where's the... Oh, it's just hidden. I'd be merging all these into one layer anyway, so this won't matter too much. Okay, uh, uh, right, let's, oh, get rid of that old B-Right back song that's been up there for ages. Here we go. Okay. Let's bring all the colours into one group. Get rid of that. Delete. Get away. One, bad, bad, bad. We did. Okay. Bring her Shadow layer right up and her highlights layer up and scales. Okay. Right. How are we going to do this? Let's move all the colors down here. Let's see if we can make another layer, please. Let it hang. Okay, I think it I think it did. Awesome. Excellent. Right, that's just while we muck around with the uh, layer blending. Soft light. what I'm after. Okay. Okay, that looks cool. As for you, oh, I didn't do the hairband before. Uh, normal. Yeah, the shadow's too dark, so we'll fix that in just a second. I just realised I didn't do her hairband. Uh, make the hairband black as well. Get 
Ja. Komm, ich mache jetzt ein Logo. Das kann man herbehandeln. Let's try something different. I can't remember what I did. Stopped light. Okay, look at that. And then what we're gonna do is um Ooh, I'm gonna stretch. Hello, who's there? I see somebody. Meeting is done. The colour is coming really nicely. I love how the base colours are coming back the highlights, low lights. Thank you. That's what we're trying to we're trying to figure that out right now. Um get that all sorted together um and the highlights looking pretty good it's just the low light i'm trying to figure out right now um and uh yeah thank you so much i, I hope you're doing it okay how's your week been how's everything going um what am i looking for? just do, 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 do. Cool. There's a few nods in chat, that's good. Yeah. yeah, thank you so much, I'm glad you like it. Yeah, yeah. we're just trying to smoothen everything out now. Um... Yeah, where's the... Where's the scales? Soft light. Okay, so now what we're going to do is, okay, let me um, oh, What did I do for Clara? Did I do a, did I just do like a red wash? Was it like this? It might have been like a, like a red clipping mask. Something doesn't feel quite right. Clipping mask. Pattern. Okay. So we've done the, done the clip mask layer. Um, not too bad about pressing slow with calls assigned to me. Oh, good luck. <laughs> yeah, good luck with all the calls and human interaction and stuff. <laughs> okay, that looks pretty cool, but we have to. Sorry everyone, just concentrating. Yeah, good luck, good luck with all, work, all of you out there. Good luck with your work today. I believe in all of you, you can do it. You've got this. You can tough it out. Um, I'm really glad I don't have to deal with much human interaction at the moment. I'm dreading having to get back into it when I eventually get Stop. Oh, goodness me. Uh, what should I do? With I'm just like blanking so much. Uh, I'm just going to quickly check another piece. 
because I'm blanking on what I did for a certain thing. So I'm just going to have a look. Clara, hello, there you are. What did I do? Oh, what's that? Okay, there it is. Layer seven. So opacity 65, normal. What color is that though? 65, and it's just completely black. Is it just completely black? No, it's not quite. Okay, cool. I'm doing it right. Sorry, everyone. I just completely... Sixty-five. Got it. Cool. Just blanking on a... sort of... Uh, process I've been experimenting with. Oh. Whoa, yeah, let's not, let's not go back to it just yet. Not ready. Um, okay, I'm safe now. <laughs> uh, cool, right. We've got, we're getting this, we're getting this right. We're doing this, we're doing this well. Um, probably going to make the colour a bit warmer. Yes, that one, that one exactly. Uh, instead of like a harsh red I was using originally, just a, just a very dark brown. Clipping mask. Flatten. 65% opaque. Opac Excellent. Alright, right. there we go. Now we're, now we're getting somewhere. Okay, cool. Um, now my favourite bit. Now we're doing my favourite favorite part. Um, excellent. Cool. Tidying up and just giving it some interesting dynamic lighting. Um, yeah, cool. Um, okay, but before we do that, we're going to do the backdrop first, which is my go-to backdrop for all of my D&D characters hide that layer I'm gonna hmm what colour should we use what colour should I use for Clara I should just put Clara on this computer because I did need to see the layers before to be fair I should uh, uh, I'm school competition oh no don't freeze please please don't freeze okay I use green for Clara I should use a different colour for Shay, even though... Oh, I'll use pink, maybe. Like a light pink. Um, or maybe I could use the same colour, considering they're all in the same... No, let's use a light pink. Uh, and then just... Yeah, that's good. That's good... Good stuff. Looks pretty cool already, right? I'm really pleased with this. Right, uh, we did some good, some good blending, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Can I have done it without you all? Right, we'll spend the next. What time is it? We'll spend the next few hours, um, just. Is it trying to the? The fresco, fresco brush looks, looks funky. Which one? Old, old brush, dry brush. These ones. Um, is it trying to emulate this splotchy paint? Yeah, I guess so. Um, it's uh, this one's called an old brush. The other one's called dry brush. Yeah, uh, they do a really good job with the blending in pro. Like Procreate is like the, the best for like simulating like different types of paintbrush and like having them like blend in with each other it's so good um i don't know if this was the brush i normally use actually for this background 
for these backgrounds. I always forget. I should really... Oh no, I think it's this brush. Yeah, it's this brush I normally use. What is this? The dry brush. I love dry brush painting. It's so much fun. I should really try and use all these different brushes more often, but I just I just get so used to the round brush and the flat brush, and they they just they're just the only ones I end up using for ages. Oh no! Oh no! Guys! Okay. <laughs> Why didn't you warn me? You're supposed to let me know before it gets full. Okay, right. We're gonna we're gonna just chat for, for a hot second. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. So we're just gonna hop over to just chatting for a second while <laughs> while I figure out what to do, what I can get. Oh my goodness. I've done so much painting, it's just... Oh my gosh, okay. Um... Oh, I'm gonna unload all of my photos. That's, that's a good one. Um... Let's see if I can do that. Photos? Because I've got like... And there's probably a bunch of stuff I can delete, to be fair. Sorry everyone, oh my gosh. Um... Yeah, optimize iPad. I've already got optimized iPad storage on. Okay, uh, storage, iCloud storage, offload unused apps, I've got that on already, D&D Beyond, okay D&D Beyond's quite, quite chunky, I can delete that, or oh, delete podcasts too, I'll be easy, oh, there's a whole bunch I can delete on here, but let's get rid of, let's get rid of D&D D Beyond, I don't need that on here, um, I only really use it on my computer, on my phone, just be gone. Go away. Okay. Uh, we'll get rid of podcasts as well. Uh, yeah. Get rid of podcasts because I don't listen to podcasts on here. Sorry, everyone. This is just a nice little, a nice little cleanup session. Um, what else can I get rid of? I can get rid of music. Get rid of all my music. Oh, I like having it on here though. We'll do offload app, offload, offload music for now. And then later on today, I think I'll go through Procreate and just delete a bunch of paintings that I don't need. Um, oh my gosh, I never thought this day would come. I thought I had so much storage. <laughs> go offload. Okay. What else can I get rid of? Um, how much do I have free? Okay, cool. I've got enough gigabytes free now that I can probably. Oh my gosh, I've used ninety gigabytes in Procreate alone. Um, that's insane. Right, so let's get back to it. We should have plenty of storage left to carry on with uh, with Shay. Um, but after the stream i'm going to go in and delete a whole bunch of stuff um because i guess this tablet all i really use for it now is, is art and stuff so there's a bunch of things i don't really need right now um oh my phone is almost out of space too it'll be all right yeah it'll be fine don't worry i always target videos first to take up tons of space yeah it's all gonna be fine i've gotten rid of the podcast app because i don't use it on here i've gotten rid of some music i've gotten rid of a whole bunch of things and I'll, I'll get rid of more stuff later so it's all gonna be fine um but usually i could swear it normally warns you if you're close but it just is like no nope. completely full um <laughs> completely full good luck with that um <laughs> thanks procreate much appreciated Uh, I'm going to duplicate that layer, bring it to the front, so I can grab the colours. Right, let's go. With not the dry brush. <laughs> oh, whoops. Ooh, 
having a day today, aren't we? Aren't we, fellas? Um, did I... We are having a day. Where's the... Oh, where's the... Ah, here we go. Um, did I... Soft light, alright, cool. Boy, Procreate is keeping me on my toes today. Um, Pixel, before you came on, it decided to erase like a weird chunk, like not even a full layer, it just really erased like a chunk of a layer and then crashed. Um, so I, that probably should have been, maybe that was my iPad trying to warn me, it just crashing. Um, Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. Wasn't quite sure if I had the right colour. Oh, goodness me. Um, what resolution does Procreate make the images? Or is Oh, you can like, you can adjust it completely um, yourself, you can do whatever resolution you want basically. I usually my, um, now I do my paintings um, CYMK friendly and print friendly and use A4 dimensions, so like I'm painting on an A4 piece of paper. Um, because A4 paper is surprisingly quite a, quite a big file type and, and quite good to like adjust and make bigger and smaller is necessary but the biggest i think the biggest point of like storage is the is the videos on every single painting i've got enabled the um process tracker oh i wonder maybe maybe i can like delete maybe what i can do is, is export all the time lapse replays and then see if i can delete them off the off the painting i might be able to do that um, and that will free up tons of space. So um, I'll probably do that as well as delete some small paintings. Just offload a bunch of paintings and delete them. Um, I think I'll do that with my A level projects because I've still got some A level work on here uh, and stuff when I was younger. Um, so I'll probably offload a bunch of those. I think that would be the best. <laughs> How's your phone holding up, Pixel? Is it is it coping okay <laughs> with your uh, with your lack of storage space?
Now she's coming to life, everyone. Yay! Everything's coming up at the house. Uh, I'm always having to find accidental screenshots to delete. Like, I'm constantly accidentally doing screenshots where I can't go. Yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> yeah, I think I've got loads of those in here as well. Um, luckily, my iCloud storage is, is quite big. It's just... It, and my phone storage is good. And pretty much the only things I store on my phone are, like, photos and music. So, so that's good. Um... But yeah, it's always, there's always like screenshots. Um, it's amazing the amount of screenshots we, we all accumulate. I, I used to, because when I was at school, I used to use my, my iPad as like a visual aid. So um, there'd be like loads of photos of the whiteboards and stuff at my school. It was always such a nightmare to go in and like delete all of it when I didn't need it anymore. I'm quite gutted as well because I've lost some of my really old pieces of art from when I was a lot younger. Um, I don't know, I think a few of them are hiding on my computer somewhere, um, but most of, a lot of them have gone. Um, and that would have been nice for nostalgia purposes, um, but uh, yeah, most of them are gone unfortunately. I have to see if I can find them after I finish my stream. What time is it, everyone? Yeah, probably not going to finish this one today, everybody, but it seems that we'll have a good... There's a... Yeah, okay. There's a good chance we'll finish on Friday. Not Friday. It's Friday. Sunday. Uh, we'll probably finish on Sunday, which is very likely because my stream will be four hours as opposed to the usual three that I like to do here today. Um, yeah. But we've made good progress. So, whoopsie, what's going on? There we go. Right, we'll focus on the face for the rest of the stream and then we'll be ready to move on for the next stream. The rest of it. Thank you. 
I don't know, it went very quiet for the last part of the stream. <laughs> That's okay though. You're getting quite close. Are you planning on adding accessories and stuff? Um, yeah, just concentrating on the detail for now. Yeah, probably gonna add some like, um, probably gonna add some like gems and and such and de details to the scimitars, but um, and maybe her bands and things. But generally, the clothes are probably gonna remain quite simple. Um, maybe maybe I should give her a little satchel or something. Um, yeah. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out on the next stream. Um, but we'll definitely uh, focus on uh, just tidying things up and bringing it to life a bit more for now. Yeah, I think I think I should add more little accessories and stuff. Like maybe maybe I'll give her a satchel or something. Some kind of bag. Um maybe I could make her hair a bit more interesting. We'll see. See what tickles our fancy. We'll just Just have to see. Wait. Be surprised for all of us. Oh, did I not colour in her hairbands either? Jade, you fool. What's wrong with you? I didn't colour in any of her hair her hair her, her hairbands. Goodbye. All of you disappear. But that there we go back to normal um yeah concentrate on detail what kinds maybe yeah we'll, we'll figure out what to do as we go back to the hair Okay, now to make the eyes pop a bit. Okay. 
Lovely and pixelated. Cool. Awesome. Okay. <sighs> she wouldn't truly be an albino with a little, without a little bit of blush <laughs> and sun exposure. Do some little blemishes on the rest of her body as well. Um, we'll keep her cheeks and face quite blushy as well. Yeah, let's make her ears a bit sun exposed as well. Cool, nice. Cool. Yeah, I'm so glad I decided to recolor her. This feels so much better than the one I was working on um, last year. Genuinely. Cool. There we go. Let's give them a little bit of glisten. Look at that. Cool. Let's get back to the skin. Jadine trademark blush, yes. <laughs> you know it's one you know it's one of my paintings when you see their face is just covered in blush. <laughs> I used to be really insecure about how blushy my face gets. I can get really red as a tomato, but now I've grown to really like it. So now all of my characters have it. Well, only if they're really pale. Um I know people with much darker skin generally don't tend to blush as much, but they still sunburn. Even if your skin is black as night, you can still get sunburn. 
That's been, that was a PSA. So everyone put your sun cream on in the summer. Because that because that's that sun can can get you when you least expect it. <laughs> hmm. I feel like I need to move the scales. Somewhere else, I think them here. I don't know if that's gonna look a bit in the way, but I'll figure them out later. I definitely need to branch out more and um, and draw characters with different different like skin tones and, and facial features and stuff. I haven't nearly. I've mostly just been drawing and practicing on Caucasian folks my whole life. I need to I need to branch out more. I th think oh maybe I should do maybe I should do like a really maybe I should do like dark elf at some point. Oh, that'd be so good. That'd be really cool. Yeah, I need to practice drawing like like black features, Hispanic features, Latina features, Asian features. I really need to just really need to branch out more. Um, and just draw mythical races, you know. <laughs> need to get get my stuff out there. Because it's no good just being good with one type of person, you know? A couple of types of person. Maybe the scales should be back there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right, we've got half, half an hour, everybody. Let's see what we can achieve in half an hour. Looking pretty good so far. What do you guys think? I think I, I'm quite pleased with how how this is going. 
one. Ooh, um, mm, interesting. Okay. Uh, Do oh yeah, scrunchy. Uh, these guys, the wristbands, the armbands. The bands, because she just has them everywhere. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad. Oh, thank you. Yeah. We're doing, we're doing, we're doing good. I'm, I'm pleased. I'm, I'm pleased with the progress. I'm so glad I started it again. Um, well, I didn't exactly start it again. I didn't get rid of the line art or anything. But I'm very, I am very glad. Um. I'm very glad that it's going the way it's going. <laughs> uh, cool. I'm excited to draw more D and D characters. If anyone wants a D and D character drawn, get in touch. Send me an email, and I will. I will happily. Get to work. And I can do it on stream if you want to. Do. Gosh, my tummy is growling again. Good job, it's almost lunchtime. <laughs> Gotta stay hydrated, my mouth is getting so dry. Hmm. Ah. Just spilling water all over myself today. The mishaps happening today it's it's in uh it's been worth it <laughs> uh did i did i make the bands the same color color as the hilt i did that's useful Because the light is coming from in front to the side. There won't be too much lighting, too much highlight on the sword hilt here. Just a smidge though. Just a little bit. Um, where's the skin colour? There. 
do some hot with my skin here though. Cool. Let's make our nails. Basically just black, I guess. Yeah. Gloves a little bit. No, don't do that yet. yet. Do it later. Um. Oh. Okay, okay. The blade. Thank goodness for the eyedropper tool, am I right? What a lifesaver that is. What a brilliant, brilliant invention. <laughs> because I am so terrible at making palettes, and I know I can make loads of palette presets, but I just don't, because I'm a, I'm unprofessional. Okay. I like this texture, it's nice. It's real nice. Who's that? Why make a palette? Like when you can suck up the colour from somewhere else. Exactly. <laughs> That's the mentality. <laughs> Just... <laughs> that's that that's that's the digital artist's way. <laughs>
Okay. Uh, let's do the blade, shall we? Yeah. The blade. Shink. Hope this isn't making you guys feel seasick. I do apologize. Nice, excellent, good stuff. Hilt time. Awesome. Yeah, I think I think I will definitely be able to. No, I'll definitely be able to finish it on Sunday. Maybe even start the girls because I don't think it's gonna take another four hours to finish, unless I do some really intricate <laughs> accessor accessories or something. Um. We'll all have to wait. Wait and see. Or oh, maybe I should give her a little snake friend. I should give her a little snake friend. Uh, snake friend. Because because you and T have snake friends. You need to Oh, you Jade, you fool. Right. That'll be that'll be Sunday. That'll be the accessory she gets. A snake friend. Um also a general cleanup. Um as well, because as you can see it's still a mess. Um <laughs> yeah, she's got a snake friend. <laughs> Even though in the campaign I haven't actually been able to find a snake friend because every time I try to roll for animal friendship I always roll really badly. <laughs> and her charisma isn't very good, so um that makes that very difficult. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, what are the, those golden snake arm bracelet things I've seen before? Oh my gosh, yeah, golden, like, golden snake arm bracelet. Oh yeah, I should have given her some of those. Darn it, they're so cool looking. Um, oh well. <laughs> Too late. Uh, but I'll definitely give her, like, a nice big snake friend. Oh. 
my phone is playing The Weeknd for some reason, sorry. I know it's those snake arm bracelets, I just googled them, I'm not really sure what they're called, but I guess snake arm bracelet thing is oh whoops, wrong colour. <laughs> snake arm bracelet thing is a good a good shout. <laughs> The city's cold and empty, no one's around to judge me, but I can see clearly when you're a oh, 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 oh. I said, ooh, I'm blinded by the lights, oh, I can't tell I don't know the lyrics. <laughs> See the sun light up the sky. Something set me to a baby. Oh, the city is cold and empty. No one's around to judge me. I can see clearly when you're gone. Ooh, snake earrings. Snake earrings would be pretty sick, actually. Yeah, maybe I should get a little earring. You know what? She's a magic user. She'd be fine wearing accessories fighting, right? I'm sure she would be. Yeah, why not? It's my character. I I can put I can put jewelry on her if I want to. Pretty much all of my other characters have jewelry on them. Anyway, oops, oops too much. Uh, cool. Let's take a look at that, that layer. Right. Um. Yeah, she's definitely getting a snake friend. We'll do that next time. I need to figure out how to get the scales to blend in a bit better. Said, Ooh, I'm blinded by the lights. I can see the na 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 na. No one's around to judge me. See clearly when you're. Hi everybody, I see there's more people hopping in. Hi guys, I hope you're doing okay. Um, feel free to come ch chill for a bit, we're going to stop the stream soon, but it's never too late to, to pop in and say hi. Um, but you also don't have to say hi, it's all good, you can just, you can just hang out. We're drawing my D&D character, and we're going to finish it on Sunday at 4 we stream four to late on Sunday. Um, Greenwich Mean Time, GMT. That's it, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> um, oh, my stomach is growling. I need food. So we're going to stop in a few minutes and we're going to go get something to eat. And 
and then on the next stream we'll give her we'll tidy her up tidy it all up maybe add a few little things and including a snake friend um because she needs a snake friend because she's a UNT. It makes sense. Um, UND are an awesome race you can play as in D&D 5th edition. I don't know when they're introduced. I don't know if it's just 5e. Um, they're very cool. They're like snake human people. Uh, half snake, half human. It's very cool. And God bless the eyedropper tool, is all I can say. <laughs> I'm drawing all this. The city's calling and fighting. No one's around to judge me. I can see clearly when you're gone. Oh, oh. So much to tidy up, honestly. Honestly, JD, you're a mess. So much to tidy up. there. Oh, hi, Dad. <laughs> Good to see you. We're just about to wrap up. Thank you for hopping in, though. Hope you're doing okay. I need to, I need to change my schedule time, actually, because I think I'm solid I can do until 12 on weekdays now. Not every day, of course. I do not have the strength for doing the kind of thing every day. I don't know how some people do it. I guess if it's your full-time job, but that's insane. Being able to do this every single day. Hello, Very impressive skill. <laughs> I get tired after three hours. <laughs> Four minutes. Oh, there's five people. Oh my gosh, where are you coming from? Hello, everyone. Um. Oh, I see. Um. Okay. 
things get out of that. This letter, actually. Just notice some of the colour from the hair is leaking out. Let's just, no, let's paint over it. That'll be easier. Easier just to paint over it. Cool. Oh, where's the uh, ring? The rim, the rim light layer. Bring it to the front. There we go. Um. smoothly I think. I think we're doing okay. Ooh, okay. Yes. I I know what we can do for more details. That's my cue. It's 12 o'clock. There's Driftless Pony Club coming at you with an arm for me to stop. Um, <laughs> mm. This was so much fun. Um, we'll hopefully finish her off on Sunday. And it's going to be real, real nice and awesome. And it'll be a four hour stream at that, that time. Um, so much for coming in. Um, we're going to raid today. Uh, we'll do our raids every Sunday. Um, yeah. And I uh, hope, you, hope you like and feel free to drop me a follow and come back on Sunday. Bye.